The Justice Department is suing the state of Texas over its new redistricting maps. The lawsuit claims the redrawn boundaries discriminate against minority voters. Joe Kalia live in Washington with more on the Biden administration's first legal challenge to a state's redistricting maps. Joe? Yeah, uh, Adrian, so the Department of Justice says that not only do these new district maps uh, violate the Voting Rights Act, but they also make the claim that they uh, discriminate against black and Latino voters. So we're going to lay out exactly what the Department of Justice says in their case. They say that Texas, over the past 10 years, has gained about 4 million people in population. Now, because of that, Texas has earned two new congressional seats. And about 95% of that population growth, the DOJ says, was black and Hispanic voters. So you might expect that these two new congressional districts would be majority black or Hispanic, and we can put them up on your screen here. Uh, they are not. The way that they are drawn, some of those communities uh, that are heavily uh, black and Hispanic are sort of drawn out. You can see the way that those district lines are. They're not only majority white, but they are heavily majority white. Uh, and so what that does, in effect, is it sort of diminishes uh, black and brown voters as a voting block. Here's what Valerie Gupta from the Department of Justice said about this last night. Decade after decade, courts have found that Texas has enacted redistricting plans that deliberately dilute the voting strength of Latino and black voters. Now, Ken Paxson, Texas's attorney general, uh, pushed back here. He released a statement on Twitter uh, where he says uh, that the suit is, quote, the latest ploy to control Texas voters. He went on to say that I'm confident our legislature's redistricting decisions will be proven lawful. So Texas standing by the way that these maps are drawn. I can tell you there are a lot of other states, Adrian, that are also going through the process now of redrawing their district lines. So far, this is the only lawsuit that we've seen from the Department of Justice uh, as a result of it. Yes, and again, Adrian. these are still claims from the DOJ. This case is going right. to court. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.